All right, so what we've gone, peeps, we've gone through, well, first of all, we've got to put our masks on. Always good to be, uh, you know, try to be as safe as we can, set a good example. So what we've done, we've ripped up the carpet, we've ripped up the underlay, and now we've got the tack strip. So this goes down and tacks the carpet to the edges. Every so often, you've got, as we've ripped it up, this is really pretty much uh, rotten out, so this was really easy to come up. Sometimes it gets hard, you have to get a chisel or something underneath. And what you'll find is, it's always nailed down to the concrete. Right, so what we do, go through with the hammer, get these pulled out, and then you'll have a little hole. You can just go through and make up a cement mix or anything like that, um, and just you know, fill them in. And then what we're gonna do, we're gonna go through and scrape any of, off, any of the carpet or under there that's still stuck down, any of the glue. We're just gonna go scrape up any of the and the little bits of uh, previously paint or anything else is on here. Uh, you know, you've got a couple of things you can do. You can grind this back, you can sand it, uh, then you can put your suitable products over the top of that, depending on what you want to do. If you want to paint it, uh, you want to concrete stain it, or you just want to um, go and put the clear finish straight over the top. So for us, we want to try to put a clear finish over the top. So we want to get it, you know, the best we can. But in saying that, we don't want it to be perfect because we're not in a perfect world and we want to add character to our home. So this is uh, what we're going to be aiming for anyway. We'll show you, um, show you the process as we go through and get it done. And from start to finish, you'll see the end result. So appreciate you all tuning in. Much love from the PBJ fan.